usual, a little bit of a, a tear came from my eye when I had to leave Yorkshire. Land of the gods. Just heard off Nigel. Nigel's joining me uh, tonight, and uh, behind the camera is Lily. Say hello, Lily. Hello. And uh, we are heading up north, and uh, I'm going to meet Nigel at Scotch Corner. Um, he just gave me a, a wee telephone call, and he's a few miles behind us on the on the motorway. And he told, <coughs> he told me a tale that he'd forgotten his boots. <laughs> he's got them though, he went back and got them. Uh, tonight we're going to a bothy called Greg's Hut. Um, I've never actually slept in a bothy before, and um, we're not particularly travelling light because we're a bit taking up coal and sticks and what have you to make a fire. So, yeah, looking forward to this one. This is the start of it. That's Nigel. Still smiling. That guy got me involved in this, <laughs> as in wild camping, and so it's his fault. Bankruptcy, <laughs> unpaid mortgages, things like that, all because got... of the kit that this guy makes me buy. You've got some good rucksacks, though. I've got a collection of rucksacks. Now that's an interesting topic. <laughs> How many rucksacks do I need, Lise? But I want another one. No way. But, got it yet? We've got no room. Well, I am getting another couple. <laughs> and you can't just get the rucksack on its own, can you? Because you've got to get the cooker and the matching sleeping bag and, uh, you know, the tent that goes with it, or tarp. Um, it's dry. It's getting dark, though. We Was it about seven-ish? Close to, yeah. Close to, and we're only expecting another half an hour of light. Um, and we've got probably a two-hour walk in. But we have got lots of wood. Yes. And I've got a bag in the back, and there's charcoal as well, and Lisa's just here. What are you carrying for the fire? No wood. No wood? Have you got some marshmallows? Yeah. Yeah, marshmallows, I'll be right. Yeah. 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 Got a few marshmallows. <laughs> Twenty past seven. Head torch is going to be used. Are we in the Lake District, Nigel? Or are we in the Pennines? Nah, we're in North Pennines. An area of outstanding natural beauty. Is there an acronym for that? <laughs> there is, Steve, funny enough. I O N B. E I E I O. <laughs> we haven't got very far, have we? We've gone quite far, Just have a quick look over your uh, left shoulder, Nigel, and tell me how dark that cloud is over there. It's beautifully dark, Stephen. Does it look like the end of the world is coming? Uh, no, no, not that sort of dark. I don't see any, oh, yeah. I don't see any horsemen. <laughs> So, uh, I think we're safe, Steve. Oh, right. Don't need to do it last will and testament, then. Well, it no. feels like we're carrying it up, but... <laughs> <you know. laughs> Never like last will and testament. I've got a, I've got a church on my back to pray in. Yeah. Oh. I'm half the forest. Yeah. I'm sure it'll be worth it. What's everybody else doing on a Friday night? Oh, yeah, sat at home. In the warmth. In the warmth. Having a beer. Like normal people. I've got some weird friends, Anna. You know what, Steve? Go on. I mentioned this to the people at work, what I was doing. Right. They had no idea what I was on about. Yeah. Really weird. <laughs> <laughs> I was like showing them on my phone and everything. Zero interest? No one interested. Zero interest to the point, didn't want them to do it, but... Yeah. 
Exist. Yeah, no, that's true, isn't it? A lot of people don't realise that bothies are a thing. Way of it. Yeah. Okay. Right on it. All right. We're somewhere near the bothy now, so I'm going to fill up my um, my water bag, and then we're going to hit the bothy, get the fire lit, and um, settle in. It is quite lit. Um, Lisa's pulled a muscle. I'm officially sick of this relatively useless head torch. But we are just arriving at Greg's hut. Yes. I wonder if we're on our own. Um, looking forward to this, guys. No idea what the scenery's like up here. We're going to check that out in the morning. But let's just get in there and make it home. I'm sure Lisa could really do with a sit down. It's unfortunate she's got all our bags to unpack, airbeds to blow up, teas to make. I fancy a massage, Nigel's feet could probably do with a bit of a scrub, but then she can have a sit down, so maybe in about two or three hours. <laughs> Party of three. Alright, okay. With fire. Sorry? With fire. Oh, with fire as well. If we could, where is the, is the fireplace in there? Yeah, there's a fireplace in here. Yeah. How do you feel about a fire? Oh, it's so much warm in here though. You go next door. Can you really tell the difference? No, really go next door. Yeah. <laughs> The amount of energy that you burn up here, you've really got to replenish whenever you can. <laughs> That's good. And if I leave it up, then it's going to be uncovered and then it's going to get wet. Yeah, but there's no need to do that. There is need to do that, Steve. There's not. This is always need, Steve. Everything is as it should be. There's some uh, fire making bits that we haven't needed, so we're leaving that for future users. We've put a little note in the diary. Uh, we've all really enjoyed the bothy. Um, a tip for you, if it's raining, I've written this in the book, if it's raining, uh, the bed end of the bothy has a leaky bit of gutter in, and the water that comes straight out of that is like a tap, and it's clear. So we've got all our water. We have filtered it. But we're all good to go and we're hoping to get a fast run down because it's uh, it's very wet outside. Really enjoyed it.
Brainy. Just the, the clouds just starting to lift. I've taken a couple of photos, but how well they come out is anybody's guess. Be nice to, to get off the hill. The rain's it's not as bad as it was up there. I mean, we're, we're descending now, so it's not so bad. It's quite marshy, quite a lot of peat bog. You've got your choice of places to get fill your water up though. Definitely going to come back here. In fact, Nigel's just he's just said that he'd be more than more than up for a another session up here so we'll have to see what 2018 brings We all had a good time? Yes. Yep. Yeah? Were you warm enough? Yes, very warm. You? Yeah. Oh, toasty. Dry enough? Oh, yeah. Do it again? Definitely. Next week. <laughs> what yeah, do you think? definitely. Yeah. Winner. Let's go.